We are in Black River State Forest at the Bear Lake Campground in Milton, Florida. There's a long road into the campground. We are at the back of it. You first come in, you can immediately turn up the first row to go into some of the campsites. Depending on how they're angled, they are angled two different ways, so you will need to look and see which way you need to pull in. It is a full loop. As you continue toward the back, there are campsites on the left. This is a Reserve America campground. When you are on the Reserve America site, it will tell you how long the driveways are. Everything here has electrical and water. Most are back in sites of various lengths. Here's an open site. And it will also tell you how much shade they have, whether they're 25, 50, or 75% shade. For us, that's important for our Starlink, since we both do have to work while we're on the road. So that's, these are sites three and four. There are a couple of pull through sites. They are right here where this fifth wheel is sitting and then one to the right of it and one to the left of it. So they are sites five, six, and seven and they are various lengths. We're now down by the lake and these is the area where the loop circles back through. Come out or go in here. Again, there's an empty site. The sites over here do overlook the water. This is a no swimming lake. There are alligators in it. The dump station is to the right with the garbage cans. Can pull through. I did pull our rig through when we got here just to turn around, but we did fit. There are two sets of bathhouses. They each have bathrooms with showers in them. And then this goes down to the lake. We're now walking from the bathhouse towards the lake. On this side is the road. There is a trail that goes completely around the lake. It is four miles long. We did it yesterday. I would rate it fairly easy. We took the dog and completed the entire thing in about an hour and a half while stopping to take photos of flowers and trees and the lake. Right now, the walk out to the lake is under construction repair but normally you'd be able to walk out on the observation deck down there and view the lake there is also a boat launch there is fishing in the lake motor boats are allowed um, if they have electric motors no gas motors allowed in the lake so here's the boat ramp And a little dock to walk out on. I'll hit your boat too. Again, there's the alligator's present sign and the lake. And then this side, there's a little loop for just tent camping. The trail comes out between that post and that tree. Woo! We're now walking along the lake, leaving the tent area, going back towards the campground loop. Here is the other end of the trail that goes around the lake. It starts here, foot traffic only, no bikes. And then we begin to get into the camping again. So some of these sites are interesting because 
they look pull through, but they're actually two sites. This one is only one, this is site eight. But it shares an entrance with the site next to it. And then as we enter the loop, be able to see how some of these sites are set up. And again, their links are posted on the reservation site at Reserve America, which was a big help to us because we know we can't fit a lot of places. But most of these have been redone with asphalt. There are a few that have not, but they're still concrete. And these overlook open areas as we come around the loop. This is one of the sites that looks like a big pull-through site, but is actually two. So as we walk into it, you'll see this is site 27. There's the water and the electrical. But as we continue through the site, second picnic table and fire ring and that is because there's a second electrical and water hookup. This is site 31. And we are on the other side of the loop now looking back towards the back. 